I've been playing around with Suno Chirp lately for lo-fi and it's pretty fantastic. So I'm going to show how I've been making a song in Suno Chirp and we're going to jump straight into it. So first I'm going to show a song that I finished and if you just want to skip forward to where I'm making the new song, you can go ahead about two minutes and that's where I'm going to start next. But first I'm going to play this lo-fi song that's been created and then we'll jump into it. Alright, so that was one of the songs um, that I created, one of the initial ones, and now I want to continue from a generation that um, I had been doing a little bit earlier and show you how I go about making a lo-fi song. So if you don't know how Chirp works, I do have a previous video on it if you want to go check that out. But quickly, um, what I did was invite the Suno Chirp bot from the Suno Discord. And when you want to do a chirp, you have to type in something along the lines of forward slash chirp. And then you click on chirp and then you enter in a command. And then you can describe the type of music, enter lyrics, so on and so forth. However, I found out that you don't really even have to enter in lyrics and you can create instrumental songs. And so I was listening to some lo-fi stuff and I was like, holy shoot, maybe I can make some lo-fi beats. So that's what I was playing around with and here I am. So this generation I particularly like, so we're going to continue from it. After that chirp command, you'll get a message that looks like this and you'll get two clips. So I'm going to play the one on the right hand side and we'll take a listen to a little bit first. Alrighty, and so this is the second clip, so we're going to continue from two. And this is how you start about making a song in Chirp. So continue from two. And then for the genre, I want to keep it the same, which is Japanese lo-fi. And so I'm not going to edit it and I'm just going to click submit. And that'll send it as the same genre as the clip that I'm generating it from. So submit. And then for me, it's going to go all the way to the bottom because that's the latest one. And it takes about 90 or so seconds for the next generation to come up. So I'll be back when that is done. And so here we get two clips and you get one on the right, one on the left, and we do the same thing. So it's a very iterative process. So quick listen to the first one. So that first one actually kind of trails down and away. So I'm not going to continue from that because it kind of ends the song there. Now the second one. 
Okay, so both of them kind of trail away, so I don't actually want to stop the song there. So this is a good example because now I can click on this restart button, which is going to regenerate the previous um, command that I had done. So I'm going to leave the type of music the same, or actually I'll just type it again. Um, and then go ahead and submit. Okay, and so these next two are finished. And that's the one unfortunate thing about the Sino Chirp is it's still sometimes random for the length of the clips. And like the previous ones, it was silent. So here are the same two. Um, let's give a quick listen to the first one. Okay, so that one continues and now two. Okay, that second one kind of has like a weird like pipe organ in the background. Um, I don't really particularly like that. So I would continue from one and I'm going to do a couple more of these generations and then we're going to finish off by liking a clip so that we can get a full clip. So currently I've done two so far and this last one is going to be the third. So by the end of it, I should have a lo-fi snippet that is about a minute and 30 seconds long. All right. And here's the last generation. We've got the uh, first two. So quick listen. Okay, that's cool. That one's starting to trail away. That is kind of great because this is going to be the last clip. Thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> so this is number two. And um, you, you probably just heard it. It said, thanks for watching, guys. I guess that's perfect for the YouTube video. <laughs> so I, 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 though it's funny, I don't like that second clip. I don't know where that came from. But this first clip is perfect. So... I'm going to click on this heart here and it's going to combine those three clips into one full song and I'm not going to play it full on here. I'll put it at the end of the video in case you want to listen to it. So if you want to stick around, that's going to be this one. We're going to stop it there for this first lo-fi song and then we'll jump into a completely new generation so we can generate a second one. So I actually have like a tavern music post that I was um, starting and it's 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 kind of cool. But I'm not going to jump into that in today's video. So we're going to instead create a new one. I'll call this lo-fi song number two. And then enter in some type of uh, filler message. So um, the reason I'm doing this is because it's all inside of Discord. And for me to keep things um, organized, it's really hard to actually do it in like one channel so that's what i'm doing instead of a forums post and so here we are um, let's go ahead and start chirp and the genre well lo-fi i wanted to do so let's do something like um hip-hop lo-fi and we'll create a song with hip-hop lo-fi but to keep things a little bit dynamic for the video we're also going to try to switch the style of music midway through this generation so we can see what might happen if we try swapping the, the genre of music mid generation all right here's the first generation let's take a listen already and now clip two And so I actually like clip one a little bit better. They're actually both pretty cool. Um, and this time I'm going to swap these genres. Um, well, we're going to do since we started initially with hip hop lo-fi, it's going to try to continue along the lines of hip hop lo-fi. But instead, we're going to go ahead and now slap in piano into here. So let's see if it picks up on that and incorporates piano into it. So it'll be like something like hip hop lo-fi piano. And like the previous one, um, this entire generation is going to be located at the end of the video if you want to listen to it after that first one, of course. All right, so this one is finished. Let's take a listen to clip one. So that one's only 11 seconds, unfortunately. So let's hope this second one is longer. Awesome. So I like that second clip and it did incorporate piano into it. Um, and so now, well, since it did piano in the pat in the previous one, let's go ahead and choose something like, let's pick it. Let's do electric guitar and, uh, do that generation. And, uh, we'll stop it at that third clip. And here's the last clip of, uh, this one. And let's do the first one first. <laughs> Okay, and then uh, clip two. Thank you for watching. 
What the heck? Okay, that second one also had a thank you for watching. I wonder what type of uh, videos they use to train this model. I'm going to assume YouTube. <laughs> so that is hilarious. What the heck? Another one. Um, well, in this case, I like one. One is is decent. And so I would click on one. And like I said, this one is going to be at the end of the video, too. So I'm surprised I got two clips that said thank you for watching i've never heard that before in these clips um so what a coincidence that i am also recording a youtube video and so here is the final one and it is a um minute and 39 seconds so you can do this for as many cycles as you want you can keep continuing and continuing and continuing um as long as you have credits to do so and so i guess that brings me to the point that Suno Ch chirp isn't entirely free so you do get five free generations per day according to chirp and inside of the Suno chat you could find more information on you know what they are charging if you want to go for a pro plan premiere um and stuff like that so i think you could probably do like a song every couple of days if you are using the free plan but here's what the page looks like if you want to get a more premiere plan kind of like how mid journey has theirs set up you got monthly and annual so that's going to be the end of today's video there are many other things that um i want to try with suno chirp like other instrumentals and whatnot it's 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 really awesome and i can't believe this technology has gotten this far to where i could literally create my own background music if i want to for my youtube videos so on and so forth but that's gonna be it for today's video if you like these type of videos let me know down below in the comments if you want to see me do any other ai tools let me know as well um if you like the video like subscribe i've got memberships open if you want to help support the channel and if you want to listen to the songs i'm playing them next so see you later <laughs>